Okay, I'm doing a short video just to uh, give you the next little update on the code. Um, and first let me show you, here's what it's supposed to work, how it's supposed to work, uh, at least partially. Uh, you could add some features, and maybe I will. Uh, in fact, I'd like you to add some features, but for starters, this is how it should work if uh, you get to kind of, you know, let, let's say you get to the B level, okay? This, this is how, how it's supposed, supposed to work. So, um, so here we have the Freedom Board, uh, and here I have my uh, my putty thing. And let's see, I could make this bigger, but I don't think it'll be bigger. I don't think that'll make any difference, really. But um, all right, so maybe what I'll do is uh, is just restart this so it's nice and clean. And then we'll do this. Okay, there we are. All right, now what I'm going to do is click here. And uh, when I type uh, one, we should, well, first off, let me hit the reset button. So there's our instructions. So it's the LED alternative uh, project. Enter one for red, two for green, three for blue. And then I'll probably add uh, four for uh, uh, four for you know orange and uh, five for aquamarine and six for white or something like that. I don't know. Uh, add a few more. All right. Now, but what happens now if you add in say let's type in a six? Oh, you added six, but you get it, but it's not an acceptable input because you really have to be one, two, or three. Let's put in a zero. Enter zero still. So uh, if I enter a D or something, any, you know, anything I enter is wrong except for one, two, or three. Okay, so now let me enter one for red. Okay, now you can see it's blinking red. Now if I hit the reset button, I pop out of that and I go back, get another prompt, and now let's do two for green. Okay, that's great. And I'll jump out of this and then I'll do three for blue. Okay, so that is, uh, so that's, 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 that would be great. And then the only thing, uh, if you get to this point, you're guaranteed a B on your project, maybe even a, maybe even a B plus. But, uh, of course, we, you know, I, I might have to take off five points for needing the additional help. Um, uh, so, in any event, um, maybe I won't be so severe. I don't, I mean, if you just at least do it, you're going to get at least probably a, Probably a B minus, probably a B anyway. Uh, okay, so uh, <clears throat> yeah, I don't know. I haven't really figured. Pretty much everybody gets A's or B's in this course. All right, so uh, so that's how that works. And then if I hit reset, I'm back to the prompt, and I can put it in a different color. And then maybe I will add the additional features. Okay, now. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to give you some additional code. I'll, I'll put it on the web, and uh, what it's going to do, it's I'm going to give you, I, I'm going to give you, um, I'll give you this code. I'll, I'll give you part of this code, but I'm not going to give you. Uh, so it's it goes to a case statement, but I'm not going to give you uh, the guts of the case statement. Okay, so. Uh, I'll, I'll put, put that, that and it'll be on uh, GitHub in uh, just a little bit and this video will be uh, available too. Alright, with that I'm going to quit.